Hi guys, how are you? It's Jordan Mead here, uh, Woodcastle Decorating. I'm sorry I can't do any demonstrating today. Um, my little uh, stand that holds the phone for the for video one is not working. So I'm just coming in here slowly as you can see. Um, I've got the, the furniture more or less finished here. I'm um, just going to go around here very, very slowly with the camera. And there's a wee bit of shelving up there. And you can see that nice satin finish. Um, uh, this was all a look finish. Uh, I'll just go over here. We have a wee chest of drawers here. Um, the new handles are ordered to go on. And if I look over here, as you can see, this is inside the, the, the these, these uh, built-in wardrobes were all um, pain. And so you can see there, um, that's where the four doors are. So I'll turn the camera around here. Uh, so where's door one? As you can see, it's a wee bit striggy. So that door at the minute has got um, two coats of primer with one finished coat. It's getting another two coats. And it's just, this is the same. This door's the same. And door three, as you can see, it's just a wee bit striggy. It's just a wee bit of the white primer coming through the, the colour train satin, which is the colour is um, uh, satin finish. And it's sorry, the colour is Harns Island. So as you can see, I'll just put a wee close up there. As you can, you can see the the finish on it there. Um, so all the shelving basically here is all finished, as I say. And uh, the ceiling's finished on the walls. I'll just go put a close up on the walls here. Uh, these walls all had an embossed wall, uh, embossed paper on it. So what I done was stripped them, prepared them, and there's a, 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 a line of paper going on there. So as you can see, I'm well on. Tomorrow we'll finish all, I'll, well, these doors have to get another two coats. I'll get these doors screwed on tomorrow. There's four of them. I'll put a coat on them, and then on Friday, I'll put the finished coat on, and I'll get the walls finished tomorrow. So there won't be too much left, I would say. So the, the whole procedure with, with this um, job basically was, I'll get I'll get to the colour for for starters. Uh, to set all those wee knobs down there. That that's the colour. That all that um, uh, that this built-in uh, furniture was. It's like a pain, you know. And um, so as you can see, it has come up really nice. So the procedure here was. Um, you know, basically um, degrease them all. Obviously, that's the first thing to do, and get a very fine sand pad, sand it down, clean it down again. And what I use is that's just all the color trend prime two. I have four primers. The prime two has epoxy in it, and it sticks to shiny surfaces. So you don't have to sand the the, the wood right back of the bar wood. You just give it a, a light sand. Uh, for the primer to take to the surface, and that's it really. So it gets two two coats of primer, and uh, after it gets that there, as you can see, that nice that's the wee chest drawers there. Uh, to sit by the bed, you know. Obviously, there's carpet and all that go down here as well. Um, that'd be nice when people get the wee hand, the, the wee knobs on it as well. Um, so two two coats of primer, and um, basically that's it. Um, a wee light sand in between those two coats of primer. Then three coats of sand. It does need the third coat. And I see these 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 drawers here and over here they have had three coats and you can see it just brings that, that nice smooth sheen finish out on, on it there, you know. Honestly you would you would I always hear a guy called Mark Nice who does a hand painted furniture in kitchens saying you'd think somebody spread it and honestly you, you really would think somebody spread this if I go close here you know uh, and feel that there honestly you, you know it, it is a lovely finish so I'll just go around here and let you see one more look I hope you like the colour of it and um, uh, hopefully I'll get my wee, uh, my wee video style working again uh, as I say I couldn't really um, uh, do any uh, uh, demonstration today painting but anyway so there you go, there's just a few wee, wee pictures. There's a nice one that we draw out. And uh, 
that color, as I say, it's called Herlin's Island Color Trend, you know, and I, if you like the color, you know, go onto their website, you'll see it there. Uh, it really is a lovely color. I done a kitchen as well in this color, and it, it, I have to say, it did come up really nice, you know, so, so there you go. Just put a wee close up around here, around you see, George, around there, there you go. As I say, when I get ready, get the, the four doors on, the, you know, when this built in, it's all built in here. But you see, I've got a wee edge just on there as well. And, uh, you know, even that's where all the work is. See these, these small edges here, you know, where, where the doors go, all those small edges for all those wee brackets. That's where all the work is there too, you know, you have to keep that all neat and clean, you know. And as you can see it on the top there as well. As you can see at the top, I just put a coat on there. You can see it's just darkening down. It's still dry. And uh, so there you go. Anyway, that's a Stuart O'Neill here. Really castle decorating. I hope you like this bit of hand-painted furniture. And uh, we'll speak soon. All the best. Bye.